I have been in ranked queue for 32 minutes and 30 seconds. That is the time of my recording. I've been in queue for so long. I kept getting an error message. I'm not sure why. But in this episode, I'm just going to try to, you know, play normal. You know, just play operators. You know, normal solo queue game. No challenges. No, um, nothing like that, really. Just a normal solo queue game. I'm trying to see where... Okay, so they went upstairs. All right. Let's see if Zofia can come with me. All right, Zofia's here. Zofia, can you come, Attic? I'm lagging. Anybody else lagging? I'm reloading. Oh yeah, our ping's super I high. I shot that damn camel took like two seconds. To I think the servers are dying right now. T2 is clear. Sophia, can you come in the tower? She doesn't need to, uh, she doesn't need to walk into the tower that way. You don't need to do that. Yeah, well, this is, uh, this is Bosch now. You should be able to get the wall. Yeah, just get it. I'm letting the Thermite get it, because Sophia just used both of her impacts. And I suck. I Dude, is anybody that. lagging? I heard that guy vault up uh, there. Oh, we all have a hundred plus ping. Look at it. Just, just look at it. Oh. Oh, shit. Yeah, it's like two-second delay this. for me, something like that. Maybe that's why I didn't kill the bandit. They still up there. Mm. That might be why I didn't kill him. I feel like I should have killed him. Bandit, no bandit's boosted on uh, bl blue box and attic. He's one HP. We need to go kill this guy. Yeah, don't do what this Zofia did. Um, whenever you have a maverick like that, like Wami's twenty. He's still he's still up there. Sophia, he, he's he's standing on ping one. Nitro. Oh, you saw him. Yeah, but this Sophia doesn't need to go below. If you just save your impacts, you know that you you can make the uh, the attic wall open when I make it soft right with Mav. Maybe they don't know about, you know, Mav uh, being able to do that or anything. We need to get Diffuser. I'm on this drone, Sophia. Uh, maybe, maybe they don't know about Mav being able to do that. Um, which, is, which is fine. But, uh, you know, if I'm Maving the wall, like, she hears it and stuff. and So, you just don't need to use the impacts there. Like, you can just use one for the wall. This is what I mean by uh, adding extra steps for no reason when it comes to attack. Like, there's no reason to make your job harder, right? Like... The Sophia goes below, nobody drones her. There's the possibility that someone's in uh, t T1 or meeting or green hallway or whatever it might be. And, uh... This one should be big window, just based off positioning. Um, but, you know, she's just overexposing herself by having to go below there just to get the stuff off the wall. Like, she, she, could, she could just come T2 uh, after I make the wall soft and we can save a lot of time. Um, as well as utility, because she used used two impacts just for those bandit batteries for the thermite. So, could have been, um, you know, a lot more simple. They have a really good crossfire here as well. He is in kids or attic. Kids. What was he doing? Was he AFK? Or was he just trying to be silent? Yeah, they had a good crossfire there as well. I'm surprised that guy was in kids. I, I'm so confused. Because he can't be an attic because the Zofia walked through there. Zofia would have died. Hmm, interesting. Before we carry on with the video, I quickly want to mention that 50% of you guys aren't subscribed. So if you guys have not hit that sub button already, I would really appreciate it. It also helps out with the YouTube algorithm. I also want to mention that I can coach you. So if you guys want a private coaching session or a private VOD review session, there's a link to my Patreon down below in the description. And yes, I do coach console players. And lastly, I also want to mention that I have a second channel. What you can find here is exclusive content like private coaching sessions. You can also find tier lists and any other content that is from my Twitch live stream. A link to that is also in the description. Mav is a, is a really good operator on this map, by the way. Just a, just an operator in general. You know, he counters all wall denial. Only real kind of setback that he has is that you need a soft breacher or something like that to open the soft wall once you do Maverick it soft. But, you know, when it comes to... You another hard breach? A hard breacher. Yeah, you can go master. I'll, I'll, I'll uh, open attic wall. Oh, yeah, we, we, don't, we don't need a... Uh, 
three hard breaches. When when he said when he said uh, do you need under the hard breach? I thought he meant you know him playing Ace. It was a different person though. But yeah, that one Mai was uh, that was interesting. I, I don't know why he I don't know why he just played that so passive. Like he could have held the cross in the Zofia and uh, probably killed her to be honest because she planted in Gen right. So mm. very interesting. They went upstairs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I need to be really careful with how I use my nades here, because we only have me as the projectile breacher, uh, hard breacher. Can you, can one of you, can you lie in? They're not, I don't call soft right now. Can you, can you lie in call? Yeah, I believe this attic wall is soft, yeah. Yeah, attic's soft here. They got that one. Damn, they just reinforced it. Oh, that's the fuck? That's crazy. They double reinforced it, that's actually wild. He's, also, he's, a, he's an attic on top of that one. One's kids. That's our guy. Can you burn ADS smoke? Oh, I kind of shot the. Kind of shot the uh, the window. I I'm watching attic plane. Didn't really realize that was fuse. It's my bad. They have a mozzie drone hacked. Yeah, they got mine. Whenever you're taking attic, always check the hatch. Is this a mozzie drone? I'm inside. Once on ping. Okay, on top of main. One's on top of main. Holding a more aggressive angle on this Jaeger. And I die. Are we still lagging? Yeah, we are. This is... This is interesting. These, these gunfights are very odd. I don't know. Like, we're all on 200 plus ping. This is really, really weird. The is this kid's clear. Oh fuck! I can't get in. I can't get in. One off four remaining. My teammates seem to be having no issues, but I, f I don't know. I feel, I feel like my, uh, my shots aren't like. I feel like my shots are kind of being sponged a little bit, so to speak. Huh? Yeah, I'm not sure what's happening here. This is really then weird. How do we win? I be I, I think all the servers are just dying Dude, right now. I'm not sure why. <laughs> because when I was sitting in queue, like I was in queue for like 30 minutes or something like that. And I got like three error codes. Like I, I was in queue for like ten minutes, one duration. I got an error code. It canceled the queue. I I was in queue for like another eight minutes. Then I got another another error code, and then like I got one after five minutes. So I think there's some issues going on with the servers. Um, I'm not sure if it's the servers that I'm currently connected to and playing on, or if it's all of the servers. Um, but this is a. Uh, this is rough. Maybe I gotta pre-fire a little bit more, because whenever I play EU, you know, pre-firing is uh, kind of a good way to kind of balance the uh, the playing field, so to speak. Um, but yeah, this is super... I don't know, the gun the gunfights gun fight. gun just feel off, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's very hard for me to describe, but they don't feel like there's a trade with my bullets hitting versus the damage output, if that makes sense. Like, I, f I feel like a lot of the enemies that I'm shooting are kind of sponging my bullets a little bit or just eating them. Um, and I'm not trying to make excuses, but, uh, Ten to go. you know, mm. always check if they're going elbow as Five well, because that'll determine how you should take bunker control itself, so I just heard them reinforce both the walls, uh, and they also have a bandit here, so I wonder if the bandit's trying to run out, let me check my drone, bandit is close, don't, don't boost up, hold on, this bandit's still here. Bandit crossed. Bandit's close bunker door. What? I killed a Rennie and she shot me back. That's correct, right? Look, Ben's in the middle of the room. Bandit's pillar. I believe he's hard left door. Yeah. That's Bandit. It's like kitchen stuff. Alright, I don't know like that.
One half. I think he's freezer. Laundry, laundry, laundry. The laundry, okay. Boy, right station usually. There's no rotate, so there he's gonna come the hallway. Oh, oh, I'm terrible. Is he in freezer? Yeah, no, 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 no he's laundry, laundry, laundry. He's, he was prone. I'm terrible. I just need to waste time here. I already won. Yeah. It's yeah. not. Get shit, mayo. I like it. As long as I stay alive there, I win. Yeah, that, 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 that was something as well. That perspective, yeah, there's something going on with the game right now, man. I don't know what it is, but that was... <sighs> okay. Alrighty. Hmm. Alright, let's play Maestro, why not? Um, I'm gonna impact your gen wall, as I usually do. Uh, the reason I knew that Bandit was in that corner is because my Ying was already out pillar, or E-box area. And I also had a teammate T1 stairs, I believe, so a process of elimination there. Um in order for the bandit to leave further away from the door, he would have to walk through the ying or the T1 player would see him cross. So uh, I knew that he was somewhere close door still based off where my teammates were. And in order for the bandit to leave anywhere further, uh, he would have to go through my teammates, if that makes sense. So that's what, that's how I knew that the bandit was close. Um, just based off where my teammates were positioned and stuff. You know, that's another thing that I talk about in this series is reading teammates' body language, and, and that's a part of it right there is, uh, you know, you know, reading their body language, and you can get a lot of info from that stuff. Can we get out of here? Yeah, yeah, I got it, but can you open the hatch over here? Yeah, I can. Need to bring a shotgun. This is rough. Five seconds left. We need. Uh, can we reinforce the attic wall as well? The left side. I have to make all the rotates. All right. Let's hope I can do this. Need to make top white rotate. Master fast. Okay, we're good there. I'm coming main door by van. If we don't throw this, it's pretty much a GG. And trophy. Oh, shit, bitch is already in. I don't have a gun? What? I was gonna run out, but... Main stairs, once at the bottom of main, on ping. Ayana, I... she's... She's swinging you, Legion. Uh, nice. Uh, last, last one, trophy. trophy. I can pretty much just play my short game here. I'm gonna swing with this Legion. Uh, four eliminated. GG. Is that a oh. video? Is this Mayo? 21 Mayo? I'm in one of your videos. A lot of people like mention me that I'm in your video. Man, it's a simp. Simp nation, yo. <laughs> it's one of the videos. It was actually on this map. Uh, I clutched around and I had a penis on the wall. <laughs> I'm getting the f out of the lobby, dude. I'm leaving the lobby. Oh my god. <laughs> How how am I supposed to remember that? <laughs> oh my god, what is wrong with people, dude? Alright, that is the end of today's video, this solo queue episode. There were a lot of very important points and kind of topics. You know, um, the Zofia impacting from below. Also, you know, if you have like a Mav and a Therm, see, Oregon is a map where you kind of need two hard breachers most of the time. Because you need to apply a pinch to the defenders, especially when there's like Oregon has so many great positions that the defenders can play where it makes it really difficult for you to try to attack if you don't clear those positions. So like attic control, generator control, um, you know, elbow, um, pillar, all of these really important places. There's a lot more than what I just said that need to be cleared. And if you don't, the defenders can establish some pretty strong positions and crossfires and stuff. So you need to clear them out of those positions. That's why you see a lot uh, a lot of the time two hard breachers being, being brought on that map because you need to apply that pinch for power positions that the defenders are going to play. So uh, that Thermite and that Zofia should have gone tower. I sh maybe had the sledge uh, with me. 
Um, or even that Zofia could have rotated um, two generators. Sorry, I said tower. I, I meant a generator. Um, you know, but if you have a Mav and a Therm, you kind of want to apply that pinch instead of just having the Thermite, you know, open the wall and having the Zofia impact from below. Because th those impacts were, were pointless pretty much. Um, they could have been used and much more important positions. Also, you know, the, the the round there where when I was playing Maverick and the bandit, you know, went out into the, went out into the pillar door, you know, kind of playing off of my teammates and where their positions allowed me to predict his position, the bandits. So yeah, overall, uh, good game, good episode. I believe it was a 4-0. Uh, we have five more placements to go. Uh, we are currently three and two, so not too bad, not too bad at all. But that is going to be the end of today's video. If you guys enjoyed or learned anything new, make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe to the channel. As I said at the beginning of the video, 50% of you guys don't subscribe. So if you guys have not hit that sub button already, I would greatly appreciate it. I also want to mention that I'm doing coaching. So if you guys are interested in a VOD review or a coaching session, there's a link to the Patreon down below in the description. And yes, I do coach console players. And lastly, I have a second channel. There's also a link to that, as well as a link to the Wichita Wolves, which I am a content creator for. So make sure you guys check out the description, all the good links down there to my social media and all that good stuff. But with all of that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you learned something new and I will see you guys in the next video.